the flying wub. Where are those three brothers going on the flying wub? The Magic Apple Once upon a time, there was a king. The king had a pretty daughter. And one day, she became very sick. Oh, I'm so worried about her since no one can cure her illness. After deeply thinking it over, the king announced to the whole country that whoever could cure the princess would become the king's son-in-law. In a village far away from the palace, there lived three brothers, and each of them had a treasure. I can see anything through this telescope. I can go anywhere riding on this flying rug. I can cure any disease with this magic apple. One day, the first brother happened to see with his telescope the king's announcement written on a poster. Oh, the princess must be very, very sick. All right, I've got an idea. The first brother suggested to the second brother and third brother that they go to cure the princess. The next morning, the three brothers hopped on the second brother's flying rug. Third brother, come on, let's hurry! Okay, I'm coming. The three brothers flew high in the sky, on the flying rug. Whoosh! Let's see how close we are to the palace. We will soon get to the palace. I will quickly give this magic apple to the princess. As soon as the three brothers arrived at the palace, the third brother gave his magic apple to the princess. The princess ate the apple and completely recovered from her illness. <laughs> Thank you very much. As I had promised, I'll take one of you as my son-in-law. brother should become the king's son-in-law. We wouldn't even have known that the princess was sick without my telescope, so I should become the king's son-in-law. What are you talking about? We wouldn't have been able to come this far without my flying rug. But the princess wouldn't have been able to get better without my magic apple. Listening to each brother, the king thought it over and nodded his head as if he had found the right answer. The telescope and the flying rug still remain as they were. But the third brother's apple doesn't exist any longer because the princess has eaten it. So, it is right for the third brother to become my son-in-law. Both the first brother and the second brother nodded their heads in agreement while listening to the king and blessed the third brother's wedding. If you had been the king, which brother would you have chosen? Anyway, it was kind and generous of the third brother to give his own apple to the princess. I'm going to become a kind-hearted person, too.